What's going on guys? Play by Play Gaming here back with another Epic 7 video and today we're doing our installment of the GVG Endeavor series and no shine today. So let's see who we're facing off against. We lost the last two GVGs which is very unfortunate so we're gonna be bumped down really 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 low. We're back at number 572. Uh, geez, okay. So let's try to find someone we can fight. All right, we got our first round here. We're going up against Kagetoru, and round one, this is this is pretty cancer. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, pretty bad. Uh, yeah, we're gonna just decor, crow it up, and hope we win. Round two, plan here is we're gonna go F. Clurry into Charles, A. Raz into the Charles, bring in Ravi, and then Ravi's gonna go. So we're hoping to nuke out the Charles before anyone else goes. So that's currently the plan. We'll see how that works. If you're ready, All right, so we go. are faster. Uh, they're gonna get immunity here, so Immunity and the heals. Uh, we'll just do some damage here, right? We'll get buff, uh, defense buff. Crow's gonna go. So this crow is like maybe 210, 205. That's a lot of damage. Um, Super slow violet. So what we're gonna do here is we're just gonna heal up, grab the barrier so that when he goes, it's at least some mitigation. And we're gonna keep working on this crowd here. This He's 8K. Okay, so 8K damage. Once he goes, crowd should. Okay, he's pretty close. Let's see, that's, um, is that enough to take him out? Might be enough. Let's go for it. We gotta take our shot here. I don't know if we can survive another one of those hits. Not enough. Which is very unfortunate here. What we're gonna do is we're just gonna keep hitting him, even if he procs. Okay, able to get the kill. Um, all we have to do now is just kind of wait until Dark Corvus goes. That Destina 17k on Celestine, so uh, is going to keep getting the heals. All we have to do is just kind of wait him out. We'll take out Destina first, and then work on crowd. I'm sure Fortune will be on our side today as well. Counter Destina. Yeah. Why not? That's why she's on Celestine. Okay, so we got Dark Corvus up. Let's uh, push the Destina. See if we can get the push. No, missed on the Destina. Uh, but we should get the kill here. Soulburn into the Destina. Um, there's no damage mitigation, so we'll do our uh, 20, 21k, 22k? Yeah, 22k. And then this crowd is just GG, right? So. The win condition there was, oh well, for the defense, was for that Violet to do sick damage, right? And he only had 8k health, so that Violet wasn't built as tanky as they usually are, which is kind of surprising, because usually they have like 12k health and they do, you know, boatloads of damage. Uh, but the thing about Crow here is that he does nothing with uh, with single turn damage, and he's going up against the uh, the Crow Dark Horus team up. So true damage versus true damage. Okay, let's fast forward. This. All right, we should be able to get him here with the Soul Burn, and then not too bad. So. That Rylet was able to get it. All right. Second fight. This one is kind of interesting. 
Let's see if it pans out. Okay, so they are not on immunity except for the Rowana. So we're gonna stick to our plan here. We're gonna go Clurry. Hopefully we don't miss. Okay, did not miss. We're gonna go into uh, the Charles here. Okay, let's go ahead and do that one more time. We got the stun, so that's actually really nice. Uh, she is not on any kind of uh, cleanse artifact, but they get the revive, so we're just going to keep working on him. She's going to go on Rabby, maybe? Yeah. No crit. Feels bad. Uh, so... What we're gonna do here is, hmm, I think we should go on the Rowana. We got the stun on the Rowana. Let's see if we can strip the revive here. Able to strip the revive? No, we weren't. Uh, let's just go on the Charles. We go one more time with the Clary. Able to push up our Ravi. Let's take out the Charles here. All right, so our plan works. Let's go ahead and shield up. Let's throw up. Proc the counter there. Let's work on the Rowana. All right, so we can burn into the Rowana. Um, they're gonna get heals and pushed up, but we'll do it anyways. Maybe we can get the defense break. Unable to get the defense break, but we got some burns on there. Uh, let's let's stick with our S1. We got max stacks on the S1. Unable to get the um, the burn or the stun. So let's see if we can get the uh, the defense break here and the provoke and strip that. Okay, able to strip, burn doing some damage. I'll protect you. So we'll just S1. Take her out. And let's keep working on this rabbit here. Maybe I'm working too hard. Counter? Yeah. Proc the counter. That's fine. The good thing is this Ravi doesn't do much damage here. So we should be pretty good. Counter every turn. All right, let's do this. Um, we'll burn. Take this. Okay, we got the stun. Unable to get the defense break though, so we'll just S one on Crimson Seed, getting some more stacks. So we gotta wait until Clurry has her um, S three, right? Once she has her S three, still. No defense break, okay. So we're gonna have to go... Uh, yeah, we'll keep with the S1. Just because I think I'm doing more damage. Uh, we'll do S3, because I think Ravi has her S3 up already. Okay, we'll bird. We'll bird her. Uh, should get it on this one. Able to get both. And then we'll S3. Just because we have that defense break. Defense break full stacks. So like 10k maybe? Yeah. It's not not too crazy. Uh, and then we'll just burn. Bring in the Ravi. Should be able to take her out here. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Not bad. Didn't lose any units. So not bad. Alright. Let's find our next fight of the day. All right, next up, we got Destiny Loli, round one. We're gonna go full counter that SSB Dizzy. I'm not sure if we will get out sustained here because of the Momo, but we probably will. So we want our Dizzy to go first here, or their Dizzy to go first, Champ to clap those back. SSB is gonna hit us back, push us forward, give us some heals, and hoping that the Rowana can go before the SSB. Otherwise, it's probably GG. Round two here, we're gonna go ML Haste, DN, and we're bringing, we're dusting off our Tenebae, and hopefully, 
we get the win on this one. So let me just uh, check Rowana's artifact because I think she is not on uh, what she needs to be here. So let's see, where is she at? Okay, so she is on Wonder's Potion Mouth, so that works for us. All right, here we go. Been testing her out with Wonder's Potion Vial. Has I have been really liking it. Uh, just because she gives that little bit of cleanse. And Rowana, since she lacks the cleanse. Alright, so hit that. Uh, at least we got the decreased damage. We'll do the S3 here so we can hit us. Hit up with that defense. Defense. And then maybe get the defense break here. Two. God. <laughs> We landed the defense break on the Momo. That's pretty crazy. All right, so we're gonna hit with our S3. We're hoping that we can get the kill here because we got the defense break on our SSB. Okay, able to get that. Really squishy team. Was not expecting that. Hoofing, fastest unit here. It's gonna push them all up. That's fine. We got the counter, but unable to do anything because she's on the immunity. Got the counter again. Able to sleep. We. What can we do here? Um. We want to save our our S three. So we can't strip, we can't do anything here. Did nothing here. Absolutely zero, zero damage. Okay, got pushed up just a bit. Got the counter one more time, able to remove that. So we'll do S3. We might be able to outspeed them here just because we get that CR push from the end. Uh, we have to... We have to heal up, right? That's probably the play. We gotta heal up because that Arby kept proccing the greater basket. And then hope that uh, hope that we can get this is some more sleeps. Shall we put an end to this little game? Heal up a bit here. I will guide you through the light. We'll do Hufini's gonna go with her S1. So she's gonna get some burns. Yeah, we'll do S2. We gotta do the S2 just for the damage mitigation and the heals. Got the burns, we got the counter. Got the sleep as well. So what we'll do here is we'll S3, hoping we'll be able to crit that, uh, that Hoofy, but the RB, we're hoping that we get the sleep on the RB as well. Able to get the sleep on the RB, so Things are slowly turning in our favor. We're gonna go on the Hoofy. Let's see if we can take her out. So unfortunately we woke her up, so she's gonna hit us with some more burns. Doing a lot of damage here. Can we take her out? Able to take her out, finally. But she's probably gonna go down to this FCC, right? Okay, the provoke there. Would you like to be my next meal? We're gonna, let's see. I think we lost our Tenebra. Right? We could, we could burn. Uh, we can soul burn here, but that's just a waste, I feel. Oh, just S1. Okay, able to get the strip there. We got the sleep as well. Uh, so, if we soul burn, it decreases school cooldowns by two turns, but I think it's pretty much GG. It's probably better just to do the, the barrier, right? We'll get the barrier and the heals here, hoping this is enough to mitigate some damage. Able to mitigate some damage here. We'll S2. Maybe we can get the pushback. Able to get the pushback this time. But does she go down? She does not go down. We get the counter. No sleeps this time. 
Let's work on RB here. S3. We could have soul burned there so we can go straight into the S2, which we should have done, but we didn't. Misplayed there. We'll go on the RB. Able to get another sleep. We'll get some more CR push. And let's see if we can take out this RB here on the next turn. Crit through the anti crit. Uh, we'll just keep focusing on the RB. And then now it's just ML haste showcase, right? Let's advance together. So we'll hit with the S1. Soul burn. S1. Guarantee the strip. And what we'll do is we'll S2 again. Because I think the RB, he's, he's close. He's real close. He's close to proccing his S3. That barrier, man. It's pretty insane. Okay, able to strip that. We'll go with the S1. No dual attack. Okay, able to resist the provoke on that. So the thing here is we're blinded. We're blinded. Uh, we're gonna go soul burn. Yeah, we'll soul burn. Not sure if that was necessary, but we didn't do it last time, so we gotta do it this time. And we'll go with the heal. As long as we don't get provoked here. That barrier, man. Is he on Daydream Joker? All right, we should be able to take him out with the dual attack. Finally able to take him out. One of those long ones today. We will S1 here. So the thing here is we didn't hit him with the S3 before, so we were able to kind of hold off on that, but he's going to start doing a lot of damage here. Okay, the provokes, so we'll S2, let's cleanse that off, he's going to get that barrier, right? Okay, no, no barrier because he's not the lowest, so let's see if we can do some damage here, almost able to take him out, that's S1, maybe... Okay, not enough. Okay, we got pushed. Let's hit him with the S1, and then that takes care of Arby, right? All right, that was a close one. We did lose our Tenebae, unfortunately, but now it's just FCC, so uh, let's chalk this up to misplay, right? Misplay, I think I could have definitely saved that uh, Tenebria if I would have soulburned on that turn, but it is what it is, so. All right, let's find our next fight. All right, we got our last fight of the day. Round one, we're bringing SBA, Silver Braid at our Murta, and hopefully we don't get destroyed on turn one. Uh, Charles there, so the thing about my SBA is she is really slow. <laughs> I have her on a tanky build, no counter, slow tanky build. We'll see how that pans out. Um, we're hoping that Liz is faster than we are. Charles is going to S3. He's going to give attack up. Kron is going to go into the Rowana. She won't die. And then Olius is going to go with the S2 into Rowana again. Or S3 and then S2, right? So we should be okay to stun and then hit him with the CC. So that's what we're hoping for. Round two, we're going to go full bruiser on this one. And we'll see how this plays out because... Um, I don't, I don't think that uh, I'll do enough damage here to take out that RB. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. So let's see how this plays out round one. You've made it this far. All right. The good thing is we won't get pushed back. My Rowana, though, will get pushed back. Or not. Able to resist. If he's on Eliha's knife, he's going to do big chunk damage here. Okay. Not on Eliha's knife. Still does a lot of damage. No immunity. So let's Thanos snap him out of existence here. 
All right, got the stun on all three. Let's hit him with the S3. Could have S1 here, but I need the CC, right? We need the uh, unbuffable, all that good stuff. We will S3 here because Charles, he is about to pop off. He's going to S1 into the S2 every chance that he gets. All right, so no burns here. We're gonna go on, we're gonna go on this guy right here, Kron. Okay, we get pushed up. He's gonna S2. Hopefully does not strip, but yeah, I mean, he's gonna strip. All right, let's go. Um, we'll go into the Liz here. All right. He is going to put up attack up, but I think we should be okay. Um, we'll go, more than likely he's on counter, uh, so we'll just do this. Get the barrier on SBA. Uh, Rowana, can she resist? Okay, resisted. And even if he kills here, uh, we still get the revive. Which I don't think he will get the kill. Just barely. Wow. All right, so we'll just take out... Uh, let's see if we can get the burn here. Oh, we didn't get the burn, but we got a silence. I'll take that as well. Elbrus here. He's going to go S2. So as long as he doesn't take out our SSB... Get some heals. He's going to take out our SSB here. And he takes out our Rowana. Is this GG? This is a GG, right? Uh, let's burn here. We need to proc something crazy. Sleeps. Oh! <laughs> oh, that worked. That works, man. <laughs> okay, we're gonna bird here. Man, that was pretty crazy. Insane. Insane. Real risky. Uh, we're going to... Uh, S1. Falconer clearly gets the turn, so we got pushed up just a bit. Uh, we're gonna get... Stripped and everything here. Almost get destroyed. Uh, we will heal, but he is probably going to do major damage. Alexa's basket pock is a hundred percent, right? I will destroy everything slowly. Okay, still okay. Um, we have the immunity, so we won't get pushed back. We will be able to get the cleanse here, so that's why I brought Liz. Um, the thing is, will we push back? We need to push back. Alright, we got the pushback. Able to get some heals here. Gotta take out the RV. Got another turn with Falconer Clary. Able to push up again. We're gonna go S3 into the RV. One, one more time. S3, another one. We're able to take him out. And now we're just gonna focus on this, uh, champ here. Got the strip. So he's on my Ayla. Um, after this, we're pretty much good, right? High effectiveness. High effectiveness crown. So we got pushed up. Nice. Uh, we'll go S1 here. Okay, the good thing is that champ doesn't do too much damage. Uh, what we're going to do here is just save the soul burn. We'll go one more time S1. Doesn't matter who goes. Clary coming in clutch. And uh, let's see, do we have our S3 up? No, we got three more turns, so we'll just S1 here. All right, we need to be careful here. Falcon of Curse and Go, we're gonna Soul Burn. Soul Burn S3, 
We don't have too much damage here. So we brought in Lilius. So that way, if he pops off with his S3, we have a chance. But I think we got it here, right? GG. Round one was a close one. That was pretty insane. SBA coming in clutch. Siren. Siren there for the win. We got the burn and the sleep. Pretty insane. Okay, hopefully you guys enjoyed that one. Like always, if you happen to enjoy the video, hit that like button. If you haven't subscribed yet, hey, think about subscribing. It definitely helps the channel grow and reach more people like you who like content like this. Like always, if you have any questions, comments, concerns, leave them in the comment section below. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.